Every day in the USA, people find themselves in court. Kirk calls the case of the people versus Chelsea Roberts. <laughs> See, it's so hard for me to punish people, really. I just, I'm, I'm, I'm good now because I got to say what I was thinking out loud. <laughs> This is going to be a plea. Yes, sir. Okay. Mr. Roberts, come up to the podium. Council, state your appearances. Well, where's my prosecutor? All right, Judge Alex Chavala. And good afternoon, Your Honor. So for public defender, Chinazi Kerry, I can really, on behalf of Ms. Chelsea Roberts. Ms. Chelsea Roberts, could you state your name for the record, please? Chelsea Roberts. All right. I have before me a plea form that indicates the defendant will be pleading no contest to an added count two of larceny by version 200 to 1,000, the one year offense. Upon her successful plea to that charge, the count one would be dismissed. There is contained on this form, and this is will be my case, but that there will be a delayed sentence of at least six months um, if the defendant completes the terms of that delayed sentence uh, pays full restitution people will dismiss court does not do delayed this court does not first of all agree to any sentence arrangement however it would indicate that what would be available to the defendant would be the same it would be the same concept but it would be in terms of what's called a deferred sentence same thing would happen that i would normally order it's just not called a delayed because that's something a little bit more specific than what does. Okay. Yes, Judge. Everybody understand that? Yes. All right. Since you haven't done anything today, you want to swear? No. Give <laughs> 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 me the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth. So you got. Yes. You state your name. Chelsea Roberts. <laughs> I'm sorry, man. I didn't mean to say that. You've done. You got a whole lot. <laughs> All right, Mr. Roberts, it's this court's understanding that you're going to be pleading no contest to a charge of larceny by conversion, 200 to 1,000. That is a misdemeanor punishable by up to one year incarceration, a $2,000 fine plus court costs. The fine could be increased to three times the value of the property, which is the subject matter of the case. If that's greater than $2,000, that would become the maximum. maximum maximum fine yeah you understand that ma'am yes all right do you understand what a no contest plea is yes all right let me explain two things about a no contest plea to make sure you understand first thing that it means is that you're not further desirous or wanting to contest this charge you understand that yes second thing you need to understand is that for purposes of sentencing the court will treat you the same as though you had pled guilty you understand that yes all right basis for the no contest plea potential civil liability your honor all right so, Ms. Roberts, to that charge, how do you plead? No contest. No. And you understand that by pleading no contest, you'll not have a trial of any kind. Yes. Because of that, you're giving up certain rights. You're giving up your right to call witnesses to speak for you at trial or to have this court compel their attendance. You're giving up your right to see, hear, and question all witnesses against you at trial. You're also giving up your right to be a witness for yourself or to remain silent, not have that silence used against you. And you're giving up your right to be presumed innocent until proven guilty beyond a reasonable doubt. Do you understand that? Yes. You understand you're giving up your right to appeal of right? Yes. Are you on probation or parole? No. Has anybody promised you anything other than what's been stated here today on the record to no. get you to plead? Anybody threaten you or coerce you? No. You're doing this voluntarily? Yes. Of your own free will? Yes. And because, well, I want to ask the last question. Council, I have been provided Washtenaw County Sheriff's Office report and have reviewed same for their case number 21 76214. Any objection to the court having reviewed that report? No objection, Judge. On a review of that report, the court does find that there's a sufficient factual basis in which the court could determine the defendant's guilt of this offense. Council, have I complied with the court rule? Would it be proper to accept this defendant's plea? Yes. Defense is satisfied, Judge. The court will accept the defendant's plea to count two. Count one is dismissed. Pre-sentence investigation and report is ordered at 14A1 probation. Sentencing in this matter will be December 13th. December 13th, 
Really? I don't need freaking makeup. 2023. 9 a.m. Pardon? Can we have a different date other than the 13th? I just yeah. You know what? You know what? I can rule. Look. All day, right? All day. Yes, sir. All day. This start. What time was her first case call? <laughs> what was it? Like 10 o'clock? 10 o'clock. All day. All day. She's just been doing stuff. Sorry. Why do you need another day? My client um, is traveling. Uh, she had previously received permission from the court to travel. She leaves on the 10th of December. She's not back until the 18th. I did. I gave her permission to travel. That is my understanding, Judge. Did I do that? Oh, I have no idea. I gave my information to Whoa, the office, see? and that's all I see? know. <laughs> see, the client wasn't even. The client wasn't even going with you. She, I don't. I usually recall. I, it was submitted from her office. I just don't know what happened beyond that, personally. So. I so think court the, hold, not, hold it. No, no, I'm not even <laughs> talking to you. <laughs> I don't. How long ago was that? Uh, I'm not green. I don't know. Okay. I don't see. Okay. Let's just solve this because apparently. <laughs> Where are you heading? Uh, to Jamaica. Oh, no. <laughs> no, 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 no. Not unless I get to go. Yeah. No, nope, I'm going to Hawaii too. <laughs> What days are you traveling? I leave on the 10th and I get home the 18th. <laughs> Defendant May. Any objection from the people? No. Why? No, never mind. <laughs> 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 right. She would freak out if everybody from the court should. <laughs> <would just take. laughs> <laughs> Yeah, for sense. Said the 10th through the 18th. Yeah. Okay, does that include your travel days? Yeah, that's when I leave and arrive back home. Yes. All right. Now it's in the file and will be ordered. Thank you so much. Yeah. A new date because otherwise she's not flying back. <laughs> well, sentencing would be on Zoom, but I don't think she wants to zoom in from Jamaica either. <laughs> November 8th. 8th? November 8th. Okay. I'll do it for you, young lady, not for your attorney. <laughs> November, November 8th, 2023 at 9 a.m. The court, her bond will continue. I will indicate I'm giving permission for the defendant to travel to Jamaica December 10th through the 18th. Inclusive. Thank you so much, Your Honor. Miss Roberts, you're welcome. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right. What else? 